How you doing today? Welcome to Mo's Math. Today we're going to show you how to cut this 6 inch long radius 90 into a 30. As you can see here, I'm creating a perpendicular corner and I'm going to create a 30 degree triangle and I drew a 30 inch run. So I have to come up with the offset. So with my Pipe Trades Pro, I'm going to enter 30, press angle slope key, tell it I have a 30 inch run. 30 inch run, press the offset key, and I get 17 and 5 sixteenths. So I drew a line up 17 and 5 sixteenths. I'm going to put my 90 in that 90 degree corner, take my square, make sure that the fitting's plumb. If it's not, I'm going to take my wedge, I'm going to put my wedge behind there and get the face plumb. That's kind of important. So now that we have our 90 in there, we're going to take our line laser, that 30 degrees our cut line, and we're going to put our laser over that soapstone line. And you're going to see it's going to project right on the side of the fitting. Very simple, very easy. Take your soapstone and mark the back. Go down as low as you can. Get one in the middle. And go up higher. Now to get the one on top, Take your square on the back side, project that up, take your level, put it on the line until it hits the square, and now you have a point on top. Okay, so we have the back laid out. Go to the inside arc. Remember how we made that line longer? Project that line to the inside arc. Mark it down low. Mark it in the middle. Mark it up high, and we have plenty of points to connect. I like to use a bandsaw blade, grab it in the throat, take, take your soapstone, mark half that line, mark in the back, the back like such, take the fitting, flip it over, do the inside throat, do the inside throat make a nice transition transition and you'll see that it's going to flow so here's the end result very little math using a line laser piece of concrete soapstone square straight edge and there you go your 30 degree fitting Mo's math pretty simple hope you like this talk to you soon